Hi, Howard here. This video has been produced to provide you an opportunity to understand how to enter the back gate into Creston using the Mount Hebron Road exit entry rather into Keston. The first thing you want to be sure you're do, you've done is to make sure that your car is out of the way of the swing of the gate. We're going to go over a few quick tips that will make this a very easy process. It will be helpful to have a flashlight, partly to see with, but also to clean out the cobwebs around the gate, around the lock, and you'll need to have your key. Using your key and the flashlight to remove any cobwebs around the lock, insert the key into the master lock and unlock it. You'll notice that the direction of the lock is on this end and you'll want to make sure you replace it in that same direction. To open the gate, lift and give it a tug and swing the arm all the way downhill. Make sure you stay on the lower side of the gate When you're ready to close the gate, push the gate uphill, give it a little lift and a push, and make sure you align the double holes where the lock fits. To replace the lock, re-thread through the double holes, making sure that the end of the lock is pointed in this direction, and push it closed, and it's locked. So I'm hopeful that this instructional video helps you understand better how to return back to Creston, open the gate safely without hitting your car, Restore the lock to its locked position and securing the back end of the property. Thanks again for watching. My suggestion is to use the front gate.